Hello, Amy here from Connect Health Fitness and Wellness and today I want to show you a massage technique that you can do on yourself that will help to relieve any stuck points, any adhesions around your ribs or around your abdomen. This is particularly useful if you've had any surgeries, um, obviously make sure you're healed well afterwards. Um, or after pregnancy when everything's a bit stretched and you might have little niggles and stuck points there also. If you want to see more videos, please subscribe to this channel. What you're gonna need for this is some kind of ball. So I have a, um, this was a bouncy ball that I got from the $2 shop. You can get a little rubber ball of some kind that you can really get into nooks and crannies. So nothing too big. That's probably just a little bit bigger than a golf ball, if you want a reference. So grab something like that and I'll see you on the floor. So you need to get comfy. So maybe pop a couple of pillows underneath your head just to make sure your head is, your neck is nice and lined up. And next you're gonna grab the ball and all you're going to do, so I want to start with the ribs here first because during pregnancy everything flares up to make room for the baby. It can kind of stay in this up flared position and if you're breathing a lot into the ribs and not getting a big deep diaphragmatic breath, you notice the difference. My tummy's moving with the ribs rather than just into my chest. It could be that the diaphragm's a little bit stuck, but the ribs are a little bit stuck. So what we're going to do is we're just going to press lightly, just rolling up and down along the edge of the ribs. And you can go down to the side, you can go around your abdomen if you wish really what I want you to notice and this is where a small ball comes in handy there so I found a little bit that is a bit tender okay and what you're going to do is you're going to lock into that area so kind of press onto it and then you're going to rub back and forth so if you can see I'm rubbing ooh, is a tender point rubbing the the skin over the deeper tissue rather than I'm not rubbing back and forth there I'm kind of locking in place and then rubbing back and forth and while you're doing this you can be keep breathing and see if that tight bit that sore spot releases itself and the pain kind of disappears a little bit. Next, when that has happened, we can roll again somewhere else. Okay. I'm fairly stuck point free. But there's another one. There it is. So again, you can press and breathe in. Send the breath. See if you can send the breath to where that ball is. Okay. So you're breathing it out, and you can press a little bit harder. If if that rubbing isn't quite working, what you can do also is you could try pressing in and twisting. So you can like almost like you're unscrewing the tightness, the tight bunched up area, and then so you're giving that a good oops good rub. There, again, not moving the ball itself, but just rubbing around. And then when that's kind of ease off, you can go and, excuse the dog right next to me, you can um, go around and try other spots. If you've got any scars, for example, if you've got a C-section scar, you could also go along a top or bottom of the scar and do the same thing, rub 
back of the ball, so I've got a scar at my belly button. So I can go around here and then I can rub because with scars they can get a bit stuck together as you're healing so doing something like that might help to release any stuck tissue so i hope that helps please comment below and let me know if you would like any other tips and subscribe to my channel so you get notified when i release the next video thank you for listening bye for now